Hi, I dropped a video a couple months ago covering three different shoes, including the Dean Oxfords, Bolton Chelsea Boots, and Beaumont Loafers from Becca Simonon. And finally, the last part of our order is here, and that is the Domingo Duffel bag in pebbled leather, or a weekender bag. Let's get to it. Before I open the box, just reminding you, Becca Simonon follows a made-to-order structure. So once you place the order online, your product goes into production, and you have it. So the order for this bag was placed on September 7th and it was done at the end of October, so just under two months. So you get an idea of the time frame when you place orders, at least on bags. All right, so comes in this canvas bag. I guess a dust bag, if that's what you would call it. Fresh from the factory. Wow. This is, this is nice. All right, there it is. Wow, the leather is, it's not stiff, it's, there it is. It's a really nice bag, come on, like, what? Come on. So going from length, it's about 24 inches or 61 centimeters. So about two feet and the width is about 11.8 inches or 30 centimeters and the height's about 13 inches or 33 centimeters so there you go and let's look at the bottom here so you get a nice view so on the outside it features one zipper pocket ykk zipper Decent amount of storage space inside, cotton lining on the inside. You have two zippers on each side, so you could close it either way or meet in the middle. And you also have a shoulder strap D-ring right here on both sides. So actually inside comes with a shoulder strap. So let's actually open this up. You have a leather cushion on the shoulder strap, be adjusted, moved around. There's the buckle. There's the clip, so you would clip that on on the outside, on those D-rings. And you could also, there are buttons on the bag, so I guess this is what the bag looks like fully open. Could buckle it down, close the buttons. Brass at the bottom on all four corners and the center to keep the leather from touching the ground. Bottom also has a structured base. It's kind of thicker, I'd say, at the bottom, so it maintains that rectangle shape. And going into the handle, nice sturdy leather straps. You also have this buckle here so you could close it together. Makes it easy to hold. All right. Now inside the bag, I don't know if I could show you like this. So starting on the inside, you have a nice leather pocket. It says that can seam it in right there. The zipper's a lot smaller than the one on the outside. You have storage space. It's pretty deep. You can place your phones, wallets, your phones. Then on the other side, you have two storage compartments. Not sure if the camera's picking that up. And it's actually kind of padded on both sides. So if you have anything that needs a little more protection, this spot would be it. It's definitely bigger than just a water bottle type of slot. So you could fit like, I'm opening my hand completely and still have enough room on both pockets. But it looks like it's split 50-50 in terms of the bag with the pocket size. And then you just have a big empty space around the middle. So overall, lots of space in the bag perfect weekender bag and what I mean by weekender bag is 
if you're going like on a week-long trip I mean this could work but it's kind of meant for they say the weekend or two days three days ish type of stuff um, three days two to three days type of um, capacity if you think about it like that so obviously that depends on how you pack and what you pack and what will last you um, but in terms of a quick short trip um, this is definitely a good size carries holds a lot holds enough and the quality of it is just superb I mean the leather it's very soft and you know over time this will definitely age well with you so let's compare it to size to myself I'm 5'9 if I hold it down it goes down to about halfway where my calves are at right? so my knees are right here and that's how far down it goes So that's how you can see the size of the bag. Now let's get the shoulder straps on. Okay. Clip it onto the D-ring. Okay. Again, you could adjust the cushion. So. This is just the standard sizing. Hold it like this. It's not full, so you can't see too much. But if there was, if there, if the bag was full, this is kind of what it would look like. And right there. And you could adjust it so you can make it go higher. Let's see if we could try doing that. This is the lowest the bag can go with the strap. So it looks like it's just above my knees. And then if we adjust it, see how high it could go. So to make it go all the way up, you gotta push the cushion back. Okay. So it looks like this is about the highest it can go because the cushion stops it right there. So this is the highest it goes. The bag is full. I believe it's where my hips are at. Right there. That's the highest. But when you adjust it to this height, just know the cushion will be all the way back, so your shoulder is probably going to be on the strap itself. But there you have it. You could also, this is what I like to do with my duffels. I'll put the strap on the inside and I don't feel like using it. Carry it around like that. There you have it. That's the Beckett Seamanin Domingo duffel bag in the pebbled leather in black. Again, really good for quick day trips, two to three days. Honestly, you don't have to use it for trips. Like you could use it for the gym or just packing your day-to-day -day essentials and taking it with you. Just, it's just an overall, I think it's a great size to be used for lots of different things, not just a quick two to three day trip. It's small enough to where you could carry it around as your daily bag. It's small enough to fit in lots of different places. Um, and the quality is just, it's, it's there. You definitely get handmade, good quality. This bag also comes in three different colors, including tan and oxblood. Honestly, they're, they all look great, and I had a pretty difficult time choosing which color, because they all look great. They're all really versatile colors and go with almost anything in your wardrobe. But I chose black, because you can never go wrong with black. So, But you can't go wrong with any of the other colors either. There you have it, there is the bag. The quality is there, the build is there, the room, the organization, it's all there. The versatility, the strap. If you're looking for a weekender bag, a duffel bag, a bag in general to just get you through day to day, this is definitely one I would check out. 
If you're interested in more Beckett Seaman and products, make sure to check out the review I did on their shoes. I covered a wide range of shoes, including the Dean Oxfords, Bolton Chelsea boots, and Beaumont loafers. They also have sneakers, which they look pretty awesome. Make sure to go check that out. The link will be in the description as well as the corner of this video. Let me know if you have any questions. Thanks for watching. Bye.